Hey, Jesse, check this out. And three, two, one, pop! <laughs> Pretty cool, right? You can try it too yeah. if you... Pretty good at this. You guys are working way too hard. You're always looking to one up us, aren't you? Cool temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Well, Jesse? So, are we doing this? Order of the Stone, it's time to get some glory. For, for glory! glory! I know we all yelled glory out there, but I'm not gonna lie to you. I was hoping for treasure. Come on, you know how these places work. The treasure's never just out in the open. Let's fan out and search the place. Petra, this place is cool. Knew you'd find it. So how do you think Ivor knew about this place? Eh, who knows? That guy's read like a million books and traveled all over the world. You probably start to learn a thing or two about a thing or two. Any thoughts on this place? I think I'd rather be in a straight fight than doing all this switch pulling stuff. But I'm glad Ivor's intel about this place was good. So, how are you feeling lately? Wither sickness free, I think. Now I'm just trying to get used to having teammates and people who worry about me. That's pretty new for me. It's nice though. Okay, I'm going to keep trying to solve this. Does me no good. Hey, it's working. Oh, wait. No, it's not. Never mind. again. Hey, Axel. What you need, buddy?
Okay, I'm going to keep working on this. Sounds good, dude. Yo. Axel, what do you think of the situation? Um, I don't know about the situation. I kind of do more blowing stuff up. So, if you need someone to do stuff like that, I'm totally your guy. So, what kind of loot you think we're going to find in here? Oh man, well, I want to make a room with an emerald floor, right? Who doesn't? I'm like four emeralds away, so getting some emeralds would be pretty sweet. the best adventures, don't we? Yeah, it's pretty sweet. I was worried I wouldn't be cool enough or smart enough or whatever enough to be in the Order of the Stone. Thanks for always believing in me, buddy. You know it. Okay, I'm going to keep working on this. Sounds good, dude. Olivia. Yeah? So, have you been having a good time hunting for treasure? If you had asked me a couple of months ago, I would never have thought I would like all this adventuring and treasure hunting stuff. But this has actually been a really good time. And I've been getting lots of great stuff to build with. So, what kind of treasure do you hope we find in here? Well... I've been working on a build that could use another couple dispensers. But some cocoa beans would be cool, too. Any ideas for how to fix this? Well, these channels of lava are blocked in strategic locations by those sticky pistons. Unblock them, and I'm guessing something cool will happen. Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. Never doubted you for a minute.
probably getting somewhere. would have been disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark, creepy passageway. This kind of reminds me of when we first found the Order's Temple. We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then. Hey, I wasn't scared. Huh, yeah. I had no idea what we were getting into. Hilarious. And to think... That was just the beginning. Yeah, and that was before we'd fought wither storms, hung out with Enderman, reunited the Order. So crazy. Bingo! All right, let's see what we've got. Cake? It's just, I really love cake. Hey, if you want it, it's all you. Oh man, oh man, oh man, thank you. Hmm, a pumpkin. Not bad. Huh, I suppose that could be useful if we run into Enderman. And, looks like we've got one more thing in here. It's... What did you find? What are you guys talking about? Whoa, that's super cool. I've never seen flint and steel like that before. That glow. Is it some sort of enchantment? I don't know. I've seen people put an unbreaking enchantment on flint and steel before, but that's not unbreaking. You could give it a shot and find out. Okay, flint and steel, do your thing. Whoa! Well, I have definitely never seen a flint and steel do that before. Uh-oh. Looks like the monsters have a death wish. So what's the plan? If you ask me, it seems like a good time for a secret handshake. Warrior Whip! Go! Come on, Jesse. Make it good. Just like you... Whoa! You guys, that was amazing! Okay, okay. It wasn't bad. Ugh, all these mobs, where does it end?
Man, this is becoming like my lucky sword. Oh no. Come on, dude. Let's get you out of here. I tell you guys, doing that never gets old. Woo! Yeah, not too bad. Killing a bunch of monsters, getting sweet treasure. Like that flint and steel thing? You gotta try it again. I'd be curious to see it again, too. I'm dying to know how it works. Okay, what should I burn first? The grass. No, that stump. Well, well. Where'd you get the new toy? <laughs> Looks a little, uh, sophisticated for you, Jesse. Order of the losers. Yeah, losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Ugh, what grief are you here to give us now? Look who's talking. So what are you ocelots doing here, anyway? The ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. Blaze Rods! Shut up, Gil. Sorry, boss. Wow, you guys are terrible at naming. That's a dumb name. <laughs> Says the heroes that just called their group the New Order of the Stone. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... ...you wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! Mmm, no. Hey, Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Yeah, Lucas is a hero, which is more than I can say for any of you creeps. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Blaze Rods. There's no shame in being second-rate, Aiden. Not everyone can do what the Order of the Stone can. <laughs> well, that's, that's just what I expect from someone as small-minded as you, Jesse. <laughs> Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. You don't get that one. It's supposed to be mine. <gasps> Some hero you are, Jesse. Fine. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, though. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. Blaze Rod! I told you to shut up! Look out, Jesse. I don't remember him being that angry before. Wow, they scared easy, didn't they? Not easy enough for my taste. We should be careful. He seems different, scarier. Man, and all because he wanted that flint and steel. What are you gonna do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. He might know something about it. Whatever it is, it's powerful. And I'm gonna figure out what it does. Finally starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. Yeah, not our fault we're so awesome. I guess so. No matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! <laughs> yep, <laughs> New Order of the Stone is back in town. Done with 
this place. It looks freaking awesome. to see a scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls and tentacles. Wow, that is one epic build. With the lava? Yeah, yeah, and the skull motif? Awesome. awesome! I will never understand your taste. Not my fault! Look out! Oh, uh, help! Oh, stop your whining. What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you. It's a fire hazard! And your face is an ugly hazard! So what's this weird structure? It's my new house, and also, uh, my gift to the community. If anyone's short on lava, this is the place to get more! <laughs> you're welcome! Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants. A little house of my own, with loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! Ivor, I like building as much as the next person, but there have to be rules. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. <laughs> It's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a right to build something as all these people, don't I? They're just jealous that I've got vision. Well, they've got... they've got... Ivor obviously put a lot of work into his new house, and we need to show it the same respect that we would show a house not dripping with lava. Leave it. I'm sure we can find a way to work around it, okay? Long live my lava house. Long live lava! Thanks, Jesse! That's right. Keep walking. Keep walking! Always nice to see a gracious winner. Ha uh ha! -huh. Haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you, Jesse? Ivor, we found something at that temple you told us about. What? You did? <laughs> yes! Great to see you again. Let's do lunch. I'll bring the carrots. There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! Well, if we're going to keep that thing up, we should at least encase the lava in some glass to make it safer. But, like, not too safe. Come on. Help me collect some sand, and you can make sure that when we make it into glass, it's the right amount of safe. Okay. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we make sure this art gets the respect it deserves. Nice work today, guys. Yeah, not bad, right? Mm, it's like we should do this more often or something. Later, guys! Come on, let's go find Ivor. This place is really shaping up. Whoa! Lucas! I don't believe it! Oh, hey guys! You have some pretty cool stuff in here. Crazy stuff. <laughs> yeah, no doubt. Lucas, what are you doing here? Admiring the treasure. Reminiscing about how, you know, I helped out on a couple of them. And you have so many other treasures. Boy, you've sure been busy. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him. Yeah. How are you doing? I really, really miss him. 
Every morning I wake up and just for a minute, I can pretend that he's just in another room or rooting around outside looking for carrots. And then every morning, I get to remember all over that he's gone. I'm so sorry. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Ugh! I hate that guy! Whatever you said or did, it really got to him. Uh-huh. We saw him, too. The Order of the Stone and the Blaze Rods are just as friendly as ever. That's an understatement. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot and the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing Maya and Gil around. Aiden's a stupid bully. He doesn't scare me. Yeah, that's what I used to say too. But he's been freaking me out lately. He got super aggressive. He demanded to know what treasure you were after next. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited anyway? Check it out. Wow. What a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to- You found it! Ah, Whoa! Dude! What is wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually... So how would you know where it was? Endless research into the cracks in reality. The artifacts that shape and bend the rules as we know them. Uh, what? That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. So? What's the flint and steel do, then? Uh, not 100% sure, actually. But I suspect that it's related to the exciting part. You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource. What a beautiful sight. Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. More powerful artifacts, huh? Did you just make that up? No, I found books, mysterious tomes referencing it on my travels. Mysterious tomes, huh? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place. Wow, old builders? You learn something new every day. Okay, so this flint and steel might have this old builder enchantment. But how do you know that's where this Eversource thing is? I've traveled near and far, Jesse. And that temple, that flint and steel, is the only firm proof that I've ever seen of the old builders. That does seem like a pretty good bet. Old builders, Eversources, ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take off? Nope, you're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. Let's get moving. This is so exciting. <laughs> Adventure! Lucas, I know it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but... Ugh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Hey, he's not so bad. Why are you being so hard on him? Uh, maybe you forgot the whole Witherstorm thing? He kinda has a history of being a world-scale pain in the butt. These trees are enormous! I love it so much! <sighs> just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Hey, let's not get all enamored with the architecture now. We've got a treasure to find. Wow. It looks so different during the day. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, long guy, are you two as excited as I am? I'm not sure that's possible. What? 
She means that you just seem to be super excited, Ivor. Look like those lava channels work anymore. Pretty cool temple, right? Yeah, it's amazing. Not gonna lie to you, Jesse, I'm pretty excited to be along for the ride on this one. night. You look excited, Ivor. Excited? I'm ecstatic. Thrilled! Overjoyed! The Eversource could finally be within my grasp! Once, sir. Uh, once we find it, that is. Promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic! We'll follow right behind you! Uh, yeah. What he said. So you think this Eversource thing is up here? Hard to say, Jesse. As the story goes, the old builders feared its potential. So they hid it away in a place where it would never be found. And ha! It never has been! What is Jesse doing up there? Well, that looks promising. Jesse, what do you see? <gasps> it's some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. But where does it lead? I don't know. This portal, it's not like anything I've ever seen. Here goes nothing. Oh, thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. I knew you were good for something. You're gonna regret that, Aiden. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, yeah? Shut up, Gil! Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. the Eversource, who knows what trouble they'll cause. Should we go back for Axel and Olivia? There's no time, Jesse. We can't let Aiden get the Eversource first. I don't usually like agreeing with Ivor, but he's got a point. Who knows what kind of trouble Aiden could be causing in there? Yeah, I guess you're right. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Don't worry! I've got you! You are surprisingly heavy. I am. The proportionate weight for my height. Thank you very much! There you go. 
easy now. Yes, thank you, thank you. Okay, what just happened? How did that portal even work? I suppose much the same way a portal to the nether works, except to an entirely different world. I think Ivor was right about this being another world. I'm liking you better by the minute, Louis. Wow. It looks like some kind of city? That's incredible. That's it! That's where it must be! The Eversource. A city in the clouds. It almost sounds impossible. I just don't know how we're gonna reach it. Yeah, that's definitely gonna be a problem. I don't suppose anyone packed one of those flying machines. Eh, uh, that's more Olivia's bag. Yeah, I've got nothing. It was worth a shot. Guess we can settle for a bridge. I don't know. Seems like a long way. Do we have enough blocks? I mean, it's really, really far. Yes, very astute, Lucas. Oh, don't be such a worrywart, Lucas. I've got this. I think this island is more than large enough for our needs. Yeah, if we dig up this entire island, we should have enough to get us over there. Pushing. I'm not pushing! Lucas is pushing! I'm just trying to keep away from the edge! It's all edge! Okay, gang. I think that should do it. Let's make ourselves a bridge. Excellent! Okay, this is our stop. Everybody off! Ivor, seriously? <laughs> Sorry. Can't help myself. You're building! I... you... I, I... I don't... Hey there! Love what you did with your town. Yeah, it's very flashy. You helped build it? Y you, you... you... you were building! Uh, unauthorized building is against the law! Wait, there's a law saying people can't build? Yes, it's forbidden! This... this makes no sense! No sense! Okay, I'll bite. Why is building against the law? Oh, uh, this is making me terribly nervous, but, uh, first those other outsiders, now you! Other outsiders? Where are uh, they? Uh, uh, they went to the inn. I I'm sorry, but that's all I know. Wait, 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 I'm come back! I'm really sorry! And he's gone. Ah, <sighs> darn. I wonder if everyone here is that... nervous. Wow. Incredible. Wow. That is absolutely beautiful. Yes. Clearly the Eversource is capable of miraculous things. And when I get my hands on it... Hey, how about you take a massive chill pill and we find it first? Yes, 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 yes! I'm just getting excited. And as crazy as Aiden's been lately, if he gets that thing, it would be bad. Well, if we beat him to it, he won't be able to get his slimy little hands on the thing. We need to find Aiden. He's got our flint and steel, and he's up to no good. But we're gonna stop him. He mentioned an inn, right? That seems like our best lead for finding Aiden so far. Agreed. The blaze rods already have a head start, so we need to get moving. We don't have any time to lose. Hey there. Are you on the schedule for the furnace this afternoon? Didn't think there were any more appointments today. Hang on. Let me see here. Dale, ten stone blocks. Oh yes, that went very well. You keep the furnace locked up? Did it do something wrong? If you wish to make an appointment, speak to the founder. Good day.
Doing okay, Ivor? Better than okay! This city is magnificent! You should really take notes for that town of yours. crafting table you're telling me I'm so hungry I could practically eat my wheat right here but I won't I'll be patient and turn it into delicious bread instead what uh what can I do for you seems pretty inefficient to have everyone sharing one crafting table why don't you just build your own what hey I don't know what your deal is but I don't want any part of it please leave me alone now thank you No building, no crafting, no brewing, no forging, unless with express permission from the founder. All complaints must be registered in person. That's it, you can stop writing now. Intense. Hey, Petra. What you looking at? Just admiring the sights, actually. This place is so cool. I'm not usually one for, like, checking out people's builds or whatever, but even I have to admit, this is really impressive. You are really focused, huh? I mean, yeah. It took me weeks to get this building permit, and I am not gonna waste it. Captain Reginald, at your service. Hey, so what are you guys up to? Ah, just supervising this citizen while she does her build. The Founder finally approved my petition. The Founder? That's her palace up there. She is the Keeper of the Eversource. Builds everything you see. Some days I can't even fathom how she keeps it all straight. She builds everything? Yeah, well, it sure is amazing. <laughs> That's why she gets to make the calls about what does or doesn't get built. Like my build. It's no easy feat to get all these oak blocks. Your petition was very well handled. Oh, gosh. That's nice of you. I gotta tell you, this founder sounds like a control freak. Control freak? You watch your tongue! How's it going, Lucas? I'm okay. Just watching these guards. They really mean business. Yeah. I wouldn't mess with them if I were you.
can't believe they just built their way right into town. I know. I've never seen anything uh, like it. Hello. Oh, oh, my. Hello again. Can we, uh, do anything for you? You guys seem like you might have the scoop. What's up with the, uh, Eversource? Well, um, mm, well, it's, it's in the palace. Were you two talking about me just now? Um, no, no, uh, of course not. Mm-hmm. Please don't hurt us. Can you two point me in the direction of the inn? They must be looking for Milo. Shh! Uh, I mean, no, 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 we don't know any Milo. Really? Because it sure sounds like you know him. Uh, okay, okay. We know of him. If you really want to find him... He's the kind of messy-looking guy. Spender's always falling down. So messy. Thanks, I guess. I'll just leave you guys alone, then. Have a nice day. Please stop building. It scares me. What? Nothing. We could have almost died just then. Oh, hush. And where should I put them? Yes, just give them here. I'll deal with them. Get out of here. Go, go! Uh, why, hello there. What can I do for you? I'm not sure what the custom is where you come from, but uh, here, <laughs> it is considered impolite to stare. I heard from someone in town that you could help me. Other people were talking about me? <laughs> they must have me mistaken with some other handsome innkeeper. <laughs> <clears throat> Out of curiosity, what is it that uh, they thought I could help you with? I'm sorry, but I'm actually quite busy. Inns don't keep themselves, you know. Lots of busy work. I'm sorry, but it's like I told those other outsiders. I can't help you. Now, please. Hey, this our guy? He tell you where to find the blaze rods? How many of you are there? I told you, I don't know anything. He hasn't told you anything yet. Is he hiding them somewhere? I am uncomfortable with this line of questioning. You sure keep saying I don't know anything a lot. Don't lie to me, Milo. That's how bad things happen. Fine, if it will make you leave me alone. That Aiden fellow did come talk to me earlier. Wanted to know where the Eversource was. Called it! I just told him what everyone else already knows. The Eversource is in the palace with the Founder. That's all that happened, I swear. What a bunch of creeps. Yes, I wasn't terribly fond of them. So, where is Aiden now? The group left for the palace, and I haven't seen them since. Attention! Attention, everyone! Just a moment of your time, please. Emergency meeting attendance is mandatory. Oh, slime blocks. Curious. I wonder what that's all about. Oh, it's the founder. I wonder what this is all about. Yes, I'm nervous being surrounded by so many people. Oh, this is not good. What are you... Oh, crap. People of Sky City, I'm sorry to pull you from your duties, but something urgent has come to my attention. A crime has been committed. A crime? What kind please, of crime? Please, please remain calm. Earlier today, outsiders built a bridge into our fair city from a distant island. Now, whether these outsiders know it or not, this is a violation of Sky City's most sacred law. No unauthorized building. Wait, is that you? Are you the bridge builders? 
obscene Eagle builders. Atrocious. Everyone, everyone, please. I didn't know it was against the law. It was just a bridge. This is nuts. Jesse, wherever you are, step forward now. I have already been informed of your identity. I appreciate that you may be ignorant of our laws, but I will warn you, Sky City is small, and I promise that if you try to hide, I will find you. We need to get to that ever source at whatever cost. This is clearly our fastest way into the castle. By getting arrested? Wait! Don't be fooled by the Founder's lies. I can help you come up with a plan to get into the palace. Here I am! I built the bridge! <gasps> Are you crazy? Does she look like she's gonna help us? Hey! Unhand me! Come with me! This is... Sorry, Ivor. I'm going away. Me too! Quick, then. Follow me! Wait, wait! I'm wait. coming hey. peacefully! That's them! They're getting away! After them! Jesse, run! Run! Get up. run. Oh. I think she's over there! Come on! Where are you going? Uh. Just in here, yes. There's nowhere to hide in here. It's a dead end. Before I take you to any further, you must take an oath. I think they went this way. You must swear to never reveal what I'm about to show you. What? Do you swear that? We can't let him get away. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. Can we please get on with it? Oh, not quite an oath, but it'll have to do. Philippe? Right this way. This is Build Club. Whoa. Everything you see before you was built from resources that my people have saved or uh, obtained. Man, can't be easy to come by some of this stuff. Nice work. Wow, this is quite the secret hideout, Milo. Very nice. <clears throat> it is not a hideout. It is a Build Club. You see, one day, a long time ago, I was just a citizen of Sky City, like any other. I wanted to make a community garden, so I put in a petition for a dirt block, and mercy me, it was granted. But in my excitement and haste to build my garden, I accidentally dropped my new block, and it fell, right over the edge. For my crime, I was tossed into the Founder's Dungeons. And I was in there for a very, very long time. Well, okay, but it was an accident. They can't lock you up for that, can they? Oh, but they can. It was deemed an egregious wasting of resources. You see, in our world, when something falls over the edge, it is gone forever. But I have always believed in my heart that just because building is risky, it doesn't mean that no one should do it. If only I had known you were builders sooner, I would have helped you all escape when I first met you, rather than let your friends be taken. But at least you are here, yes? I would like to save Lucas. Milo, our friends are in trouble. We have to help them. Yes, I know, hey, I... Hey, Milo! Ah, hello, my friends. Bringing in outsiders? Seriously? Pretty hard to keep this a secret club if you just bring people in. Yeah, we have it hard enough as it is. Everyone, please! Yeah, it's hard enough without you bringing in a couple of randos. Uh, you want to get out of our faces, pal? What did you say to me? You heard, Jesse. Back off! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hang on, hang on. I swear, they're cool. These aren't just any outsiders. They're the ones who built that magnificent bridge into town today! What? Dude! Milo, jeez! Milo, are you kidding me? The most wanted criminals in the whole city? We gotta turn him in before the guards break our door down. Well, no, let's not do that. I assure you, harboring them is worth the risk. They are the epitome of Build Club material. 
builders. I'm not sure. They say they're builders. Oh, perhaps a challenge? All right, then. If Milo says you're these amazing builders, prove it. Yeah, build something. Now, see here, this is all highly disrespectful to my guests. I'm the leader here. Hey, Milo said that you guys were going to help us. And they will, I swear. Just please help me appease them. They're nervous. We don't know many recipes, so if you just show us some... ...thing that they build where you come from. You're gonna be just fine, Jesse. Jesse, it took us many weeks to scrape together this inventory. Please, use them for your build. Okay. Thanks. Build! 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 Now, what do you think the outsider's gonna build? No idea. Let's see. Anyone got something to take notes with? No. Darn. I guess I'll just have to try to remember all this then. Meh? Getting nervous yet, Milo? <laughs> what? No, of course not. All this day is... <gasps> Wait, Jesse! <laughs> Jesse, what is that thing? Is it... is... is it safe? Everyone! Everyone, please! It's not as bad as it looks! What? That monster! It, it wants to eat us! No, no, it won't hurt anyone! It's totally tame! I can understand why the guards are after you. I mean, that was awesome! Right? I told you! Yeah, we're really sorry. Wowzers. So sorry. <sighs> yeah. Sorry. You're sorry. Hey, these things happen. Apologies totally accepted, dudes. Now, uh, how about that whole getting us into the palace thing? Yeah, that would be great. Ah, yes, of course, of course. That is, after all, why you are here. I must say, though, after seeing you in action, your skills are even more impressive than I could have imagined. So impressive that I wonder if I could implore you for a tiny favor. What kind of favor? I help you get into the palace... You help me steal the Eversource for my people. Unlimited resources for everyone! I'm overwhelmed at the thought. Are you kidding? We had a deal, Milo. You can't keep changing it around. Yeah, you said you'd help us. And I am helping you. You just need to know. This is the deal. Fine. Now, as for how to get into the palace, According to my informants, the Founder keeps the Eversource behind a secret door located in her throne room. Dramatic. Every night, the Founder leaves guards at every door, but there's a single window at the back of the palace that is left unguarded. It's an almost perfect point of entry, but it is far too high. <laughs> if we can find a way through that window, the Eversource would be practically within our grasp. Wow, the Founder really outsmarted you guys with all those laws of hers, didn't she? I... I don't understand. Ah, uh, adorable. It means you guys need to start thinking like builders out there. We're gonna make a ladder. Building ladders? Craft a way in? If you could show us how to craft something that would reach the window, we could get this heist underway. Forget this day! Okay, my friends. This should take us right into the throne room. 
Once inside, we will just need to find the secret entrance that the Founder supposedly uses. Isn't it exciting? On our way to changing everything! Hey, would you keep it down, Milo? We're sneaking in, remember? Sneaking? Right, right, right. My apologies. I'm just so excited. Actually, out in the field, applying ladders to a wall! I know. I know. Why are you saying things to me that I already Whoa. know? Whoa! Jesse! Jesse! Petra! Boy, am I glad to see you guys. Right back at ya. I'm so glad you two are okay. What happened to you? We were in the dungeon, but we broke out. It's a good thing you guys are here. Aiden's going after the Eversource. Which we obviously can't abide! We're here to get it first! Fantastic! That is what we are doing as well! Who, uh, who's this guy, by the way? I mean, I assume he's cool, right? Oh, right. Milo Lucas, Lucas Milo, Milo Ivor, Ivor Milo. He's a new friend. I am charmed. Yeah, yeah. The Founder's secret entrance is supposed to be somewhere in this throne room. If it's in here, we'll find it. I'm getting a very door vibe from this. Yeah. What happened to it? Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's got to be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap! Looking. Still looking like it needs power. Don't worry. I'll find the answer. Okay. I believe in you. Lava and water, placed exactly far enough that when they collide, it creates cobblestone! Genius! So, how was prison life? Oh, it was wonderful. I've always wanted time behind bars to work on my poetry. That was sarcasm, in case you were curious. Jesse, what are you doing? <laughs> Sorry. Habits of the Endermen by Soren. Wow, how'd that get here? Yeah. 
see anyone. Not yet, but the acoustics are funky in this place, so it's hard to tell when people are coming. We shouldn't hang around. Got it. a lever, this would be the perfect spot for it. The rest are just inventory registries and legal information. Boring. Can you believe it? We got in! Yes, I'm very grateful to you for all of your help. Give yourself some credit, Milo. You've done Build Club proud. Huh. I get the feeling this is a special tree. Yes, the ground you're standing on is actually the original island that all of Sky City started from. That tree dropped the saplings that grew into every tree on the island. I may not agree with the Founder's methods, but even I must admit, that's an impressive feat. Wow, that is pretty special. must be where the Founder crafts things for the people. That is ingenious!
Hopefully no one will miss one dead bush. Perfect. I think that should be everything I need to make a lever now. Okay, let's do this. My apologies. It is still just such a thrill to see someone so confident and sure in their building abilities. Zombie, sheep, pigman. Curious. But what does it mean? Hmm. Eggs? The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and give it a shot? Sheep? Is... is that a monster? That's not so bad. It is fluffy. The eggs all have creatures inside them. And they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color-coded what's in them. So, she can just spawn things whenever she wants to. Stay on your toes! We're close! Ah, I can't wait! <sighs> Let's take a look around. Source. It's just a chicken! So the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make monsters, and the loot from the monsters made this place. We'll throw it in the minecart and let's get out of here. We're still taking it, right? The chicken that the entire city depends on? Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people! With it, we'll finally be free of the founder! But that clucking thing is what we came for! Ivor, geez, Lucas is right. We can't just steal or kidnap. Chicken nap? We can't just chicken nap the Eversource. It's the only way these people survive. What? 
I thought that was the whole point of this adventure. I knew it. I knew you were here to steal from me. Ah! Uh, pain! Oh, she's too fast! Just give me a second to catch my breath. Hey! Don't you dare hurt them! Says the trespassing criminal. It's just like I told you, Founder. They're here to steal the Eversource. Classic Order of the Stone. You don't say. What? No! Don't believe that! Are you kidding me? You just want it for yourself! You just expect me to believe a bunch of criminals? Aiden warned me that you were a pack of thieves, and here you are, prepared to make off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy, when you put it like that, I almost feel bad. Yep, afraid I'm going to be taking the chicken. It's mine now. What? This is outrageous. Aiden, don't do this. Somebody order eggs. Creeper! Look out! Oh! I've got Aiden! Save the foul load, you got me, Lucas. Gotcha. Thank you. Thank you. Focus! Ah! I'll take it from here. You're down here too? Lucas! You made it! Oh, yeah, only slightly worse for wear. Ah, gotta say, Aiden's tougher than I remember. Mm. Got me pretty good. Guess Aiden was a little too much for you, huh? I had it under control. I just... Ah, didn't expect him to fight so dirty. I was so sure I could take him while you helped the founder. Uh, speaking of whom, is she okay? She's just sort of staring. Let me ask. Founder! Miss Founder? I, uh, hope she's not in shock or something. Wow. So, guess you were wrong, huh? About there being no ground? I had no idea. How... How could I have known? <sighs> mm. This has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land below us. Well... Land is going to be a pretty big game changer for you guys. I mean, it's going to change everything. 
Yes. Look at this place. Totally untouched biomes all around us. Yes, it's all a little overwhelming. What, what do I do now? Well, how about you start with a few deep breaths? <laughs> you can bring all of your people down here. They won't have to, to petition for resources or any of that stuff anymore. I, I suppose you're right. Yes, we have to go back up and tell them. Getting back up. My word, you're right. We need to do that. I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. not a good sign. Aiden must be going crazy with those spawn eggs. Monsters everywhere. This is going to be bad. I can't believe Aiden could be so stupid. I can't leave my subjects in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden. Help me protect my people. We did kind of start this mess. I'll do it. But I'm doing it for your people. Not for you. I... yes, yes, of course. Thank you, Jesse. Okay, getting back up. Getting back up. Let me see what we've got to work with. Hmm. That'll work. What is it? Ah, oh, I see where you're getting at. Nice. Well, would someone care to explain it to me, please? Get ready to build the tallest thing you've ever built. What? We're going to build a tower of dirt, all the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much dirt as you can carry. Okay, that should do it. Jesse, what is that? It's the other half of the portal that brought me here. Man, what a relief. I mean, once you get that flint and steel back, it should be a straight shot home now. Well, guys, ready? Yes, I, I think so. I, uh, I think I actually gotta sit this one out, Jesse. Aiden got me pretty good. I'm just not sure I'm up for towering all the way back up there. I'm really sorry. I probably wouldn't be able to keep up anyway. Sit back, Lucas. Jesse's on the case. <laughs> I knew you could handle it. There you go, buddy. Thank you for trying to help. It was very noble. Hey, what's with the last goodbye tone? I'll see you guys when you get back. Oh, give Aiden another punch for me. Will do. Come on. We've got an epic climb ahead of us. We've got a city to save. Ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. Oh, and Jesse, I appreciate what you did up there. Trying to save me, I mean. He needs our 
is under attack by monsters, ma'am. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Aiden. Come on. We need to stop him. I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Jesse, you're alive. Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo! under attack by monsters, ma'am. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Aiden. Come on. We need to stop him. I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Jesse, you're alive. Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo! on your feet. But with all seriousness, how are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Quick version? You know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. You speak truthfully, my friend? No. Well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. 
Thank you, my friend. We'll see you on the other side. Taking over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one can get inside! We need to stop him. I know. Jesse, take one of these. They're all locally sourced and handcrafted. I use only the best ingredients. Got any potions of invisibility? Here! Can't stop what you can't see. Back down and get out of my face, Reggie! You're delusional, Aiden! The people of Sky City will never bow to you! You killed the founder! Yeah? Well, you're gonna be next if you don't sh- Aiden, you lost! I saw you fall! You went down! You're alive! You're alive! He's the founder with you! I heard- <laughs> What the- Reggie! Not one more step! I killed you once! I can do it again! You thought you could just kick me off the edge? Unfortunately for you, Aiden, I'm pretty tough to kill. Just die already! Turn to left while you have the chance! Someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. Oh, it just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, look around you. It's over. Give up. No! You don't get to tell me that! Right? Here! Here! 
You want your flint and steel back, huh? Take it! It's yours! Just, please, don't hurt me. You did it! Jesse, we need to get out of here! What do you want to do with him? Please! This place is getting worse by the minute! You can't just leave me here! Take me with you! After everything you've done, I'm not sure you deserve that kind of mercy. No, 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 no! Come on! You can't just leave me behind! If you leave me here, I'll die! Leave him! He made his bed. He can lie in it. What? No! You can't just... How dare you! Stop ignoring me! Caden. We heard the fighting. He tried to fight me. He didn't win. You retrieved the Eversource. Yes, ma'am. Everyone, stay together! Jesse, there you are! Jesse, the situation is getting out of hand. We simply can't stop all the monsters and protect my people. The longer we stay here, the more danger my people will be in. We need to find an escape route. The waterfalls. The waterfalls can take us to safety. What? Are you crazy? The waterfalls will just take us into the void. We'll die if we fall down there. But there's nothing but monsters up here. The void won't kill you. There's land down there. Everyone just watch me and follow my lead, okay? Jesse has done nothing but help us so far. I will show you just how much I believe in Jesse's word. you enough. You've saved us all. So what do we do now? Everything's just so different and scary. What do you do? You go have fun. You guys were cooped up there so long. Now you can do whatever you want. <sighs> I wonder what happened to Aiden. Hey, cards. Check out what washed up right next to me. Uh, Freeze, criminals! You're not going anywhere! Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. I knew they wouldn't get away. Ooh, I bet the blaze rods are in for a bad time. These Sky City people are not happy with them. Yeah, hopefully they dig a deep hole 
bury them in it, surrounded with lava, and... Sorry. Got a little carried away there. Attention! Huh? Attention! Hello, hello, everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free. Build whatever we please. Wow, those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Hey, both of you, fighting isn't going to solve anything. It will if I win. Oh, of course you'd think that way. No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan. But you can't schedule and organize everything, either. People need to be free to try new things. But you gotta be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. Well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. We may disagree about how to run this place, but I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. Try and play nice with Milo, okay? I know he's a little crazy and you don't always get along, but he really does care about the people. Yes, I'm starting to see that, and I will do my best. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but she's all right. I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for Nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. Been a while since I've had to start from square one. Ugh, just when I thought my days of punching trees were behind me. Oh, that's right. In the middle of all the fighting and everything, I almost forgot. When I was on the ground with the founder before, I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Yeah, I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Did I not mention it either? Because I could have sworn I said something. No, you didn't. Huh. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on. Oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. Oh, I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. It looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we gonna do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides, continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. Now that you don't have to run everything yourself, maybe you could use the time to travel. There's a lot to see. Yes, that's a rather nice notion. How would you like to go explore some of those, um, very tall vertical rocks? We call them mountains, usually. Lovely. After so long being the founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend, Benedict. Ah, uh, that's a boy's name. Huh, what a closed-minded attitude. Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, there goes the Eversaurs. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? Oh, I just saw those pigs and, you know. Oh, yes. He would be really happy to know you're still having adventures like this. See? Just like I told you. One portal back home. Ugh. 
I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No, a little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> Livestock's no proper treasure. Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Come on, guys. Let's go home. Wait till Axel and Olivia hear where we've been. They'll never believe... It... That's... Not what I was expecting.